what's going on guys? Tad here and welcome back to another Roblox video. Today on Roblox, we are playing Get Crush by a Speeding Wall. Ah! <gasps> and as usual, I am joined by Janet. Whoa. And Kate. Woo! And today guys on Be Crushed by a Speeding Wall, I or the three of us, are gonna be trying to complete the impossible obby at the end of the speeding wall. Also, we're gonna be trying, and I say trying because I don't know if we can do it, trying to complete the impossible wall at the end of the speeding wall. So those two things are things that I've wanted to do for a really long time, and by really long time, I mean like three years. I've been wanting to do this, and I've never done it, I have attempted it. I wanted to do it back when Janet and Kate first recorded this video three years ago. And now today, I am gonna be trying to do it, which is finish the obby, impossible obby, and finish the, well, get past the impossible wall as well. So first thing we need to do is we need to make it to the winner zone, the area down here labeled people who survived. That's the first thing we need to do, all right? But we need to get into that little hole Jan and Kate are in right now. They have speed potion on, which I don't. I just have this grappling hook. Okay, now we gotta wait down here until the wall goes past us. What are you doing? Oh no, let's go. We can make it. Sorry, I didn't know it was already open. Okay. We just made it. Okay, we made it to the winner zone. Right here, we're listed as people who survived. Now, this is what I'm talking about. We had to do the impossible obby. Then we're gonna attempt to do the impossible wall. And this one here just takes you back to the start. Now, there are some free things over here you can use. But you can't use them in the impossible wall, and you can't use them in the impossible obby. But you can just play around with them if you want. Okay, so I practiced the impossible obby, I didn't beat it. But I do have an idea of what you need to do. So let's go ahead and the three of us will try this and just do as I do, okay? And it's kind of bright and difficult to see. Wait a minute, I heard a oof. That was me, I had speed on. Oh yeah, yeah, Janet, you might want to just go ahead and kill yourself and reset your character so you don't have speed. Okay. I'll wait for you guys at the top of this yellow section. This part here is really, really easy, okay? This is not the impossible part. This is the possible part, not the impossible part. Wow, you caught up to me already, Kate. This is not a competition. But you're way better than me. Okay, Janet, everybody's watching you. Everybody's watching you. Okay, now this is like the impossible part. Now you can't barely see. Hey, J Kate, don't go, don't go. But there are invisible walls. And oh. when I say invisible walls, you can barely see them. But if you look really closely, there's an invisible ball right here. And it comes out to right here. You can see that it's kind of a different color pink. And what you need to do is kind of, I, I like to turn sideways and avoid oh. that wall. <laughs> I died. I think you had to jump around it. No, no. Trust me, Kate. I know what to do. Hold on. I'm coming back. Okay. Did you guys see that first wall? Yeah. Okay. Now, after you get past the first wall, you want to walk straight across. Yeah, like that. And then you want to turn and go down there. Yeah. Just a little ways and then make a left turn, Janet. Kate, where's your hair? What? You don't have hair. Oh. I want to be right up against the back of this thing. Okay. Now you can see there's a wall right here. You can see the outline of it here if you look really, really closely. And then there's a wall over there on the, my left-hand side now. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there is. And then I'm gonna go straight up between these two walls, then zoom out, then rotate my screen, and then zoom back in, and then go to this away. And there's a wall right here, guys. I don't know if you can see it, but it's very, very difficult to see. It's very faint. Then you go straight. Can you guys see clearly on the, your screen where these walls are located? Um, kind of. Okay. Not really. And there's another wall right there in front of me. Can you guys like um also bump into each? We can bump each other. Okay, that's a problem for this next part. Okay, so there's like a conveyor belt part, okay? And you can't bump into each other. Anything red kills you, including that those two small red blocks right here and here, but that gray block, that's safe. 
So what I recommend is you go down either the left side or the right side, and then what you want to do is you want to jump over, over, then under, then over, okay? So that's what you want to do. So let me just watch me, okay? So you go over, over, under, Look. then o <laughs> over, <laughs> but don't die. And yeah, okay, I'm back to this part. Are you back? Yeah. Just waiting on Kate, okay? Let's just go ahead and go for it. I'll go for it first. Over, over, under, over, and stop at the gray block. Now, you want to jump over the next one and go down to the basement down here, okay? I don't know if you can see me down here, Kate. My arm's sticking out. Are you allowed to touch that red that you're stepping on, maybe? The what? The red. Yeah, this here, yeah, this is safe. Okay, so I'm just going to go head on over to the next section and show everybody how dark it is. Okay, guys, this is the dark conveyor belt. You can't see anything, but you can stand here and wait for daytime. Right now, it's nighttime. If you wait for daytime, you can see everything a lot clearer. Or if you turn your screen angle to the side, you can see that there is a walkway. And eventually, the walkway ends and falls into a void. So you gotta be careful of where the walkway ends. And drop down, and you are here, good job. Okay, now, it's turning daytime, as you can see, right? Mm -hmm. So now you can actually see the floor. Now careful, it's a conveyor belt, but you can just run straight. And now that it's a little bit more daytime, we can see exactly where we need to go. We need to go across to here, there. I can't really say it too well, but it's there. So let's just give it a try. Okay, I'm on. Don't know if you can see it, but I'm on. Okay, then we need to drop down to there, which we a moment ago we wouldn't have been able to see it at all, but now we can. And now this tower. Now this tower looks kind of easy, but it's actually a bit tricky. Trickier than you think. It's easier to fall backwards than go forwards. See, I just about fell off the whole thing. In fact, I'm going to go the way you guys are going because it looks better. But I don't want to bump into each other, so let's just go one at a time. I don't like obvious that you can bump into other people. Let's just see if we can... Is this a possible... Yeah, it's a possible jump. I'm not a pro at obbies, guys. Not only that, when I'm recording, I get... I feel a lot more pressure and nervousness. So I don't play really as well. Oh, I don't do as well at obbies when I know that there's an audience watching. I don't have that clutch gene where you're clutch under pressure. Hmm. Kate's probably already done it by now. You know, she's a pro. Kate. I made it! What do I do up here? Are you serious, dude? You done already? Yeah. I was just joking, but like you, I, I kind of had a feeling that you would have made it already. Wait for us. Do you mind? Yeah, Jane's almost here too. What? You guys are so pro and fast. I made it. I'm glad this wasn't the challenge. I would have been eating whatever. Something gross and disgusting, nasty. Well, actually, I would have known more about how to do it and maybe gotten a lead. Get up there! Well, you're kinda almost here. I can't fit through this crack. Jump, like, walk up that. Oh, I wanted to go through that crack. How am I doing, guys? You're almost here. Really? Yeah. Okay. Just one, two, three, four, five more. Huh? Just don't want to fall all the way back down. It'll be so sad. Oh, here we are. Okay, finally. No, I didn't make it. Okay, go ahead and touch that. I think it should be a badge, right? No clue. Okay. You got a badge. Oh, you got that badge? Okay, great. The Impossible Course Award. Oh, yeah, we got the Impossible Course Award, guys. So we did beat the Impossible Obby. Now, we're going to attempt to beat the Impossible Wall, which I don't even know if that's possible, but we're going to do it. And I'm going to go to the shop. And as you can see, I have 12,465 coins, and I'm going to get, gee, you know, I don't have 25,000 coins, and it's really expensive to get this absolute insanity potion. But I'm going to hope 
that this is good enough. The faster than the wall potion. Now buy it. 10,000. And equip it. Okay, I have it. In my inventory. What do you guys got? You guys got 6x potion. I have a feeling that's not fast enough for the impossible wall, but we're gonna find out. Okay, this is the impossible wall. I'm gonna drink my lightning potion. And then as soon as it backs up, guys, we gotta go. Go, go, go. Oh, mm. ah! <laughs> it came back. Hold on. Get up, Ted. Get up. I think you're a lot faster than the wall. I am way faster than... Oh, crap. Those red bars on the side. You can't touch those. There's doorways, guys. Get in the doorway. Are you in the doorway? Yeah, we're in the doorway. You can't touch the red neon stuff. No, I didn't know that. I think that's what killed me. Huh? I'm so fast, it's hard to even control myself. Oh, and those other toys that I did have in my inventory are now all gone. I can use my grappler in my flying cloud, but they're so slow. They're like, so slow. Okay, here we go. There's only one hole in the wall. That's the only one? And I'm just gonna go for it. Me and Kate made it. Made it? To where? The end. What's at the end? Nothing. We're gonna stuck in a red box. Oh, wait. Hold oh. on, I want to see what's at the end, but I can't control myself. I keep running into the bar. So you got to go into the hole and then wait for the wall to pass you. And then go back out. <sighs> That's going to be hard. Maybe I should buy the... Whoa. Whoa. Maybe I should buy the... <sighs> oh, man. Why? Okay. Maybe I should buy the 6X potion. So you made it with the 6X potion. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to do that. Maybe it'll give me a little more control over my character. Because right now, I'm struggling. All right, I equipped it. That faster than the wall potion, guys, is so hard to control. Okay, here we go. We're 6x now. Yeah. I'm running. Actually, I feel like, you know, if you had maybe even just like 4x potion, you might still be able to make it. Okay, I'm just gonna wait here, because I can get behind the wall, right? Yeah. Yeah, when the wall passes, go. Did you get a badge for making it? Yeah. There's a trophy. You run into the trophy and you get teleported somewhere. Really? Can't yeah. wait to see it. You'll be disappointed. I don't want to be disappointed. Uh, yeah. Um. It's just a room. Hello? Why is it so dark? No, like, if it's daytime, it's just we're stuck in a uh, red box. It's a red box room, but you can't see it because it's nighttime? Yeah, but if you run to a wall, you die and get a badge. Okay, I don't want to do that. I just want to... I'm going to get some hot sauce. Maybe that'll help lighten up the place a little bit. I want to show the room. Okay, that's not much of a flashlight. I was hoping... Why am I so dizzy? All right, we'll just wait for daytime, guys. What do you get? <laughs> Narwhal. Where's that? Uh, it costs 445 points. 445 It's the best points. thing I can get. Okay, cool. Not a wall. I'm going to get the avocado because I just like the looks of them. Even though it's only 30 coins, I'm going to get them because it looks cool. Oh, finally. Okay, I see a little bit of something here. It does look like red walls. Okay, so let's move around a little bit to the center of the room. It's just an empty room, you think? Mm-hmm. Is this as bright as it gets, Janet? Um, that's how bright I saw it, and then it turned back at night. I don't know, though. Okay, so this is it. I waited, we've we been waiting here for it to turn not daytime. Been waiting here for it to turn daytime, and this is as daytime as it gets in this room? Um, maybe, maybe we should, me and Kate joined the room when it was turning night again. Maybe it gets brighter? Okay, so that's it, guys. I think that's as bright as it gets in this room. And what are you supposed to, how do you get out of here? Die. Touch the wall. Okay. Let's touch the wall. You sure? Because you aren't dying. Oh, don't hold your potion. Wait a minute. I see the world out there. I'm gonna try and sneak through this wall. No, you can't get out. But I saw the world out there. How about over here? I can't die at all. <gasps> oh, there. Oh, when you die, you get the impossible wall completed badge. Cool. 
And what do you spawn? Okay, you spawn here. And let's go back to the start, just to see. Ah, oh, a little trumpet plays. Oh, there's my avocado. Oh, he's so cool. Okay, guys, so that's it. That's all I have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you could do me a favor and give this video a like, I would really appreciate it. That would help me out a lot. Thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. I love you all, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, Bye guys!